Hi there, my name is Dan Goldstein, and I'm the lead developer of Acoustica's revolutionary Mixcraft recording software. Today we're going to take our first look at Mixcraft 5. I'm going to go through some of the major new features with you, and show you how to use them. With Mixcraft 5's new video scoring features, you can load video files onto Mixcraft's video track. You can edit the audio, edit the video, combine parts together, or take other videos and easily crossfade between them. Half a mile. The great coral reefs. Select multiple clips in Mixcraft 5 then right click and use the new link menu to link the selected clips. Now anytime you move one clip they'll all move together as a group. Simply click the unlink button on a clip to remove it from the group. With Mixcraft 5's automation features it's possible to automate every control of every effect. Simply select a parameter, draw in your automation, hit play, and then watch as the knobs automatically move along with your automation curves. I know I'm man, cause you're with me. Use this to add reverb and other effects to only parts of the music and remove it from other parts of the music. I know I'm man, cause you're with Watch me. the mix knob. You make the world spin faster. You give it gravity. You can also use automation to automate the volume of a track to create fade-ins and fade outs. Use the master track to automate global effects as well as automating the master volume. Easily fade out the end of a song using the master track with one simple volume automation. Send tracks, also known as auxiliary buses, allow us to use one effect on multiple tracks. For example, we will use this reverb effect on both these drums and this guitar track. To control the amount of each track that's sent to the send, we can use our automation pane and add some of each track to the send track. We can also use our mixer to control how much of each track is sent to the send track. Mixcraft 5's mixer is a powerful tool for mixing a large project. See all of your tracks in one place. Easily solo and mute tracks and adjust the volume and pan. Every track also has a three-band equalizer, which you can use to make simple EQ edits to your track. With one click, bring up the track's effects. Or, on instrument tracks, bring up the instrument dialog, as well as the effects dialog. Mixcraft 5's notation tools allow you to see your MIDI data in sheet music notation form. You can also edit and create new notes directly within the notation view. Ooh. 
New instruments in Mixcraft 5 include the Lounge Lizard Session Electric Piano. <laughs> which emulates the sounds of classic Fender Rhodes and Wurlitzer electric pianos. The Messiah polyphonic analog synthesizer, which emulates the sounds of the classic Prophet 5 synthesizer. Acoustica Expanded Instruments 1, a brand new collection of synthesizers, pads, and other tones. The Alien 303 bass synthesizer is the perfect tool for creating rich, thick, synthesized bass tracks. New effects include the Pultronic EQ110P, a recreation of a vintage tube equalizer. Use the 110P to dramatically color and shape the sound of your mix. Add the roughness and distortion of 1960s recordings or the high fidelity of modern sounds using this equalizer. Those are just some of the revolutionary new features in Mixcraft 5. Mixcraft is faster and more powerful than ever before. We didn't have time to cover everything, and there's quite a bit more that Mixcraft can do. But I hope you'll take the time to explore and discover what Mixcraft 5 has to offer. From myself and everyone at Acoustica, thank you for using Mixcraft.